Senior Education Reporter Tricia Powell Crane has been named an Education Reporting Fellow and will embark on a six-month-long fellowship project to explore the solutions high-achieving, high-poverty schools in Alabama use to create success for their students. The fellowship, created by the Education Writers Association, comes with a $5,000 grant. Crane has identified 43 of Alabama's 1,300 schools statewide that are what she calls high flyers on statewide achievement tests, even as they manage high student poverty rates and other challenges. With Alabama about to receive more than $3 billion in federal coronavirus relief funding, we have a huge opportunity to help school officials and communities spend funds in a way that has the biggest impact for students, Crane said. Crane also recently won a $5,000 grant from Edgenomics, a research center at Georgetown University that focuses on school finance. She will use that grant to examine disparities in local school funding around the state, in collaboration with University of Alabama at Birmingham researcher Peter Jones. The Alabama Education Lab is a new project from AL.com to explore solutions in K-12 education in Alabama that can help all children in the state reach their goals. Read recent projects about summer learning programs, vaccination efforts and teacher morale here. The Ed Lab is exploring alternative revenue to support its work, including grants and individual gifts. Two new reporters are supported in part by a grant from Report for America. To learn more about the Ed Lab's work and be notified about future stories, events and ways to support its work, sign up for its newsletter, Ed Chat, or contact editor Ruth Servan-Smith at rservan at al.com.